Hi, hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Joe D. How you doing, man? Hey, I'm ready for another beer, man. What about you? You know what I'm saying? I, you got to be ready or you wouldn't be watching. Come on. Don't be trying to fool me like that. Let me let me get this part started over here and yeah. then pause it. There we go. Okay, cool. So we've got Ballast Point uh, Mocha Marlin. Haven't had a Ballast Point beer in quite a while. So, uh, and I don't see a date on this one. Oh, on the box. Um, it's in code so it's encrypted they don't want you to know but you could really find out if you want to okay uh this is Ball ballast point brewing mocha marlin and it's a porter with coffee chocolate and natural flavors okay ballast point brewing is out of uh san diego california Okay, and this one was bottled and crafted and bottled in San Diego, California. 6% uh, ABV. I'll get right into it right here, into the screen share. Da, 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 just a second. Da, da, da. Hey, there you guys are. So here we are in the <clears throat> uh, on the website for, for uh, Ballast Point Brewing. Uh, coffee and chocolate come together in this brew. Uh, our black... Marlin Porter is the perfect beer for a mocha mashup. <laughs> the addition of coffee and coca plays perfectly off the roasty, chocolatey flavors of this English porter, while a hint of vanilla soothes it all out. It's full-bodied, but not too sweet. Try it for breakfast or dessert. Okay, its availability is in 22-ounce bombers or on draft. And it's 6% ABV, as we discussed, as we mentioned already, and it's 42 IBUs, okay? Their food pairings are braised short, braised short ribs. Swear to God, you better invite me. Texas-style chicken, again, better invite me. And chocolate molten cake. Swear to God, does it look like I don't like chocolate molten cake? All those, you make it, you, you have it with that, you better invite me. I swear to God. <laughs> Okay, I'm Beer Advocate. Um, gets a score of 91 out of 38 review, uh, re, re, blah, 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 reviews. Okay, it's styled as an American porter. They called it an English porter. I would tend to go with with what the with the brewer says. You know what I'm saying? Um, and then on Untapped, you don't see me on here. This is my Untapped right here. Joe underscore D on Untapped. If you want to friend me. 11,942 ratings on here, okay? And it's got a 3.95 bottle caps, which is really good, as you can tell, uh, from all the other reviews you've watched of mine, of course, and you better be watching. <laughs> Check them out, please. Okay. Um, I like the cap on here. It's kind of cool. Uh, I believe the other ballast point that I had was... Um, Da, da, da. There we go. Sorry. So you can see the cap. That's kind of cool. Um, it, it was off of the draft, and it was in a crowler, which is a can, kind of styled growler, 32 ounces, and um, they, they, they can it for you right there at, at, at different breweries that you might go to, which was really cool. I love that. Um, preserved the beer perfectly. So this one I'm dying to try. I've got, I whipped out my Modelo glass. I don't know if those, you you have to be watching for a long time to see this glass because I haven't whipped it out. I haven't whipped it out in a long time, baby. <laughs> so it's ready to get the dust knocked off it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay, man, let's see if we get some smoke. I got to pop this open. We're going to check the smoke. I got to take a picture for untapped, right? You know, because, you know, you got to take the picture and then, uh, and then we can do the rest. Okay. So here we go. Oh, oh, it didn't really, the smoke didn't really like flow right away. It took a while. You know what I'm saying? It creeped, man. It was, you know, it was on the, it was on the, you know, on the slope. So that's okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, good things take time or something like that. Right. So, not the ideal glass, but it's the glass I wanted to use. So leave me alone. All right? <laughs> I love that color, man. Look at that. That is beautiful. That I love that. It's the 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 uh head is a, is a nice uh light brown. 
tan, you know what I'm saying? Mocha, okay? And and the porter is just completely blacked out. Love that, okay? Beautiful color. Ooh, 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 man. See, I already I just said it and I almost forgot already. That's crazy. All right. Let me get a little modello in there. I like the modello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Let me let me turn it. No, let me get that out of there. Okay. Okay, baby. Okay. It's better if I whisper. There we go. Got the picture. Okay, cool. But let's see. Oh, yeah, you do. You get a nice smoky, and and the smoke is. This one's kind of more of like a like a wood smoke. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a little more of a woody type smoke, not so much a meat smoke. You know what I'm saying? Ah, oh, but it's it, you know, and the chocolate is right there. That you get a nice big chocolate, nice bready, uh, malty type of smell. Cheers. Oh, man. And the coffee was in there as well. Really in the back, though, on the nose, right? Well, I guess the coffee, it, the, it, it was like a coffee kind of smoky mix in there. But, man, do you taste that coffee when you when you sample it? Mm. God, that is good. <laughs> Loving this, man. Let me see here. Oh, this is good. This is a definite two thumb beer. Bing, 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 bing. <laughs> loving this, man. We gotta, we gotta go in deeper here, man. You know what I'm saying? We gotta go in for another one. Hey, I know it's it's anything for you guys, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm, you know, I'm I'm risking it right here, man. You know what I'm saying? I'll, I'll go in again. <laughs> We got some people in the chat. Sadiq, hey, what's up? We got Gabriel in there. We got Neri, hey, what's up, man? I was trying to get a hold of you the other day, and we couldn't figure it out. Anyway. Mm. Oh, this one's fun. What do you think of that glass, too? That glass is cool, man. That's the old style uh, Modelo glass. Love it. Mm. With the gold rim, baby. The gold rim. See, you know what I mean? I, I didn't pinky up it, man. I just kind of kept it, you know, gold rim. So all the points on my man car are still there. Yeah. Mm. God, that's good. Whoo, loving that, man. Get out there and get you some of this. If you can find Ballast Point in your area, get you some of this, okay? That is fantastic. You know what? So far... I have not had a beer from Ballast Point that was even mediocre. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> no charge. And, of course, I used my snake bite bottle opener. And they still sell these things, man. Get out there and get you some and tell them Joe sent you. You know what I'm saying? Hook me up. Uh, nice, clean bottle cap for those of us that, that care about those sorts of things. <laughs> All right, man. Thank you, guys. Peace out, man. Oh, Earth, Earth there, man. You know what, man? Loving this beer, brother. Loving it. Mm. Mm. Oh, my God. That is good. I, you know what I like about it? It's not it not it's not that sweet. You know what I'm saying? It's 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 nice and dry, and it's not that sweet. It's just the coffee is right in the front. It's still there. And then it goes, you know, it, it stays there just the right amount of time on your palate. Mm. And then it just mm, and real nice, easy, smooth goes away. You know what I'm saying? That's what I really like about it. The head's still there. Look at that. This freaking beer is good, man. One of these days. One of these days, Alice. You know, I'm gonna go up there to San Diego. One of one of the guys I work with just did a beer tour in San Diego and <sighs> I ain't gonna get on all that, okay? Because I ain't, I don't want to depress everybody. But he he kind of let me know. It's kind of one of those things like you're all hyped up to go to Vegas, and then you finally go to Vegas, and then you're like, woohoo! I'm in Vegas, bitches! Suck it, right? You know what I'm saying? And then you get there, and then you don't realize like how many people there are on the street, like handing you stuff. Hey, buy this hoe. But no, buy my hoe. Buy my hoe. Hey, take this, take this flyer, take that flyer. You know what I'm saying? Oh, do you want to sit in the chime shirt? Or you know what I'm saying? You're like, oh man, this sucks. 
Like the only way you don't get harassed is to just stay in a casino somewhere. Whoa. I'll check your <laughs> doorbell. <laughs> <laughs>